Hello, my beautiful sweets. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening. It is afternoon here in North Kapalaki, and we are having some thunderstorms and rain, and we need this rain so bad, you guys. Ugh, let me get this mat out of the way. It is warm. It's still very, very warm here, but we really, really need some more of this rain, and I love when it's thundering. I was sitting inside my house reading my morning scriptures and drinking my coffee and I'm going to come back and share a small little Dollar Tree haul with you guys. It's not much. I was just sitting here reading my word. I have to write in my journal today because I missed almost the whole month of May. This May was a, definitely a trying month for me. But y'all see my cover on my Bible, on my Bible is still really good. It's hanging right in there. It's not giving me any problems. So yeah, I'm going to finish this cup of coffee and finish reading my daily um, word for today. And then I will come back and share a small little Dollar Tree haul with you guys. Y'all have a great day. Stay safe. Okay, my beautiful sweets. A few hours later and the sun is trying to come out but you can see how much it rained I had to move the rug from in front of my patio door but it is still very very sticky warm and sticky out so yeah I'm gonna go inside and get some of this stuff going I went um, I've been doing a lot a lot of cleaning y'all I've been trying my best to get my house in order I mopped all my floors yesterday. Thank you, Jesus. I was so, so disgusted with my kitchen floors and I really, really should have taken it before, but I refused to mop it before I did all that baking. And that was a good idea because after all that baking I did, woohoo, it was even worse. I managed to do uh, two loads of laundry yesterday. And I still got, I think I still got a load of towels. Yeah, I still got a load of towels in the, in the dryer, I believe. Yep, I got to get the towels out of there. Don't y'all see my little messy laundry room? My brother came to my house one day and he gave me this washer and dryer. And he didn't even recognize it because I had put all these stickers and stuff all over it. But I still have more stuff to put in here. I just got to find room and, and take the time to put it in here. But whew, it's been a busy, busy, busy week. And my weekend is not looking any, any easier. And in my room, I managed to declutter everything that I wanted to declutter. The top of the dresser. This one over here I showed you guys before in a previous video. I'm still... Um, trying to change out the winter, the summer and winter clothes, and I'm donating a lot of stuff because my fat butt is probably never ever going to wear this stuff ever again. And I showed you guys my Dollar Tree closet. It's hideous, but it's organized to me. So I know where everything is. Um, I'm thinking about making a Father's Day giveaway in the Solo Cup. I'm not sure yet. I'll announce that when it comes. I still have to get to this part right here. All this stuff in here has got to be gone through totally. Get all the expired stuff out. All the stuff that I'm not using. Stuff that I can resell. Then I still have to do underneath this cabinet. Ugh. It's so much work and I did this to myself. I can't even blame anyone else. <laughs> then I think I have a basket of stuff here. Yep, that I have to go through. So yeah. I've got quite a bit of work to do, but you know, we do everything in little increments and we get it all done. Today I'm washing up my jars right now to make some homemade granola because I've got yummy Greek vanilla yogurt and cottage cheese in my refrigerator and I have no granola so I've got everything out over here 
I'm going to put some wax paper down here and then I'm just going to make me up some granola and I'm just using whatever I have in my house. I'm not going out and buying anything. I'm just using what I have, which I love to do. I love to utilize what I have. And I think that's it, you guys. I got to vacuum the floors because I didn't get the vacuum yesterday. So I got to vacuum up the floors. I dusted the furniture yesterday. Oh, yeah. I do have to get these corners cleaned out again. Every time I clean this corner out over here, y'all, I fill it right back up. And if you see all this stuff over here, that's all my bumblebee stuff that I've been putting together. I have no idea what I'm going to do with it, but it's an idea. It's there. <laughs> so my Dollar Tree haul is over here, but I'm going to come back and share that with you guys. Uno momento. All right. I'll see you guys later. Y'all, I forgot to show you my Obama purse that I bought a couple of months ago. And I finally just got around to changing out purses. And I really, really like this because it's nice and big. It can hold a lot of stuff. But I like it mostly because it has this over-the-shoulder strap that you can adjust however you want. So, yeah, I finally got everything in there. And as you can see, it's nice and neat now, but... <laughs> It won't stay like that, but uh, it also has a pocket on this side, which I can just drop my keys down if I want to, but I usually just carry my um, lip balm, some Tic Tacs, and usually some gum in this pocket, so I don't want to overload it, but yeah. All right, guys, I'll be back. Okay, my sweets, I've been running these streets all day long, and I was on my way to the Dollar Tree, as always, because I have to get my fix. I want to know, I was having withdrawals, and I was like, why am I having Dollar Tree withdrawals? But I realized I hadn't been there in a couple of days. So, on my way to the Dollar Tree, I remember that I had used my last roll of paper towels, and I do not like to be in my house without paper towels. So, I just stopped off real quick at the Family Dollar, which was right on my way. And I just picked up a pack of the Sparkles for $5. These are the smaller rolls. These are the um, spirited prints. I like the prints on them. They call them spirited prints. Pick a size. And yeah, I just like these because they're only $5. <laughs> so you get six. I think at Dollar General, both the TP and the paper towels are like only $5. But I come to the Family Dollar, depending on what way I go to the Dollar Tree, which is usually this way, I come to the Family Dollar first then the Dollar Tree, and then the Dollar General. So typically I will always stop off at the Family Dollar first. Anyway, I digress. While I was there, I was looking around. I took some pictures. I showed you guys some, some pictures of things that I found in a walkthrough. But this was what I really found, and I love this. This is on my community page. I put this up. This is the Be Happy Doormat. Let me tell you something, y'all. One of my subscribers, my girl Susan, she sent me a picture. And it is still in my gallery to this day. But I thought she said she found it at the Dollar General. Dollar General. Yeah, the Dollar General. So I had been going to, like, all these different Dollar Generals looking for it. I went all down into Raleigh to the Dollar Generals looking for it. But I went into the Family Dollar, y'all, and there it was. I was like, oh, my God. God, I wanted this doormat so badly. This was $5 at the Family Dollar, and it's by Family Chef Accent Rug, and I'm praying that I can put it here in front of my door, and I will be able to open and close my door, because I have a lot of problems with finding mats that are thin enough for when I go to open my front door, it won't drag the rug. So. Either way, honey, I'm going to use this because y'all know I am be crazy. Not know I'm crazy anymore, but be crazy. And I was so happy to find that. So I finally, finally made my way to the Dollar Tree. Actually got there. Whew, that was a hard job because I kept stopping off at this place and that place. And I was like, oh God, am I ever going to make it to the Dollar Tree? This should have been in a, in a previous haul that I, when I showed you guys before because I bought well maybe not I bought this steak the pineapple steak the same time I bought that uh, pink flamingo one for the pink challenge but I wanted to sh put this with this haul and again they're just by garden collection solar steak lights and this one is the 
pineapple and it has the thing on the top which I prefer them on the top because the sunlight hits them better than when they're on the side but anyway I digress the tab hasn't been pulled I didn't even check the flamingo to see if the tab had been pulled but yeah the tab is still intact here so and again I've showed y'all before this is how they come out you turn them upside down and you stick them wherever you want in your yard or in your potted plants so I did go ahead and get the pineapple because it was just cute. It's just too cute. And I was like, what is this? And I probably should have gotten more, but then I think about it and I go, what for? I don't camp. I don't have a, you know, a thing out in the yard to have bonfires or anything. But I was intrigued. This says, quick survive, fire starters, lights any fire fast. I was like, what? Look at this, y'all. This is quick survive. This is absolutely great for campfires or fireplace, charcoals with chimneys, charcoals without chimneys. This is what they have on the back that says you can use them and you get about three, yeah, you get three fire starters in here. So I was like, oh wow, if we ever have a pit like at the beach or something, this would be really great to, you know, to take with me just in case. Alright, so I got that because I had never seen anything like that at the Dollar Tree before. <sighs> and I've been shopping around for the Father's Day stuff just in case I decide to do a Father's Day giveaway. I know it's crunch time. It's coming up on us real quick. It's the 20th, right? The 20th of June. So, anywho, I found this beard cape and I thought that was so cute. It's a beard trimming cape and you... It has these little suction things on the back where you put the bottom part to the mirror and then you, um, he can cut his hair or shave his hair. However, let's see if we can get that to focus. You see how that looks? That's pretty awesome. I was like, but you know, you don't have to use this if you don't want to as that. I mean, shoot, I can use this to cut my hair and put it over around. I don't even have to suction it to the mirror or something. We can always find other things to use this for, but I wanted it just in case I do decide to do the Father's Day giveaway like I did the Mother's Day giveaway. Okay, I have this light, this LED night light that I keep in my bathroom at all times. This is my favorite, all time favorite one. I accidentally hit the circuit breaker, the little part that says reset, and it blew. So I had to go to Dollar Tree and get another one. But aren't you happy when these things go out and they malfunction or whatever, that they only cost you a dollar to replace it? So this is one of my favorite ones that when I'm like half sleep and trying to make it into the potty, <laughs> this light, this illuminates my whole bathroom without putting the light on. So I love this particular one right here. So I went and got another one. Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> And then I found this on a clip strip. I had been looking for this, but I would, had been looking it down, for it down the kind of like the man's aisle where they keep the drainer, the snake thing that drains and stuff. So I was looking in that area. But one day I went in there and they actually had a clip strip on the cleaning stuff by the cleaning supplies. So I found it and I was very happy because I really could use this. This is the Dr. Reuter Plumbing Tube the tub edition. It's a hair cyclone. It's guaranteed to catch every strand of hair. Never clogs, never get hair clogs again. So I got that and I was like very happy. I only bought one. I was going to buy two, but when I saw that it said it was the tub edition, because I was going to buy one to put in the sink in case I wash my hair in here. Sometimes it depends on my back and my legs where I will wash my hair at, but most of the time I will wash it in the shower. But yeah, it says insert the cyclone into the drain, installs in seconds, the hair wraps up neatly around the cylinder, simply clean and reuse or dispose of the cyclone. Easy to use, easy to clean, don't shower without one. Okay, and y'all know, this is Dr. Reuter, so this is a name brand item, you know, I think. I never heard of them, but it looks... It looks better than a Dollar Tree item, so, so I got one of those. I was happy and excited to get that. Okay, let's move them right along. Crafted Square has been spitting out some, some awesome, awesome stuff in all that titanium. Uh, what is it? Galvanized? I always want to call it titanium. 
they're calling it galvanized and I'm hoping that this person doesn't have these because I think I heard her say she did not find the galvanized numbers I don't know if her friend has them or not but I got the galvanized numbers these are pretty big too y'all they're pretty big ones now the letters were a little bit smaller and I don't know understand why but this is what they look like over here and you can see the size of them so I got the galvanized numbers and I'm probably gonna send those to her if she doesn't already have them and then I got two of these bottle caps and they look so much bigger on on everybody else's channels but when I got to my store they were you know cute I saw these already down in Raleigh 101 times you know but I just never paid much attention to them because I'm not a real crafter but these are Crafter Square metal bottle caps and they're so cute and I believe I think she said she couldn't she didn't find any of these so I'm hoping to ship her these because every time I get something to ship to her I think that she doesn't have she already has it <sighs> I digress <laughs> moving right along I found this Freeman Beauty Infusion purifying in a shower mask what sea kelp and probiotics instantly boosts clarity restores balance renews skin it's a serum infused facial mask dermatologists um test it so i'm like what is this going on here purifying in the shower mask i've never seen these and i don't believe i've seen them I've seen a lot of masks. We didn't get a lot of those masks that were going around the, the Korean ones, the nice ones that were going around to everybody else's stores. We did, never got any of those. We still might get them. I don't know, but no, they didn't come to any of my local stores. So, and if they did, they sold out before I got there. That's what I always have to say because a lot of times we'll get stuff, but they, they're they'll be sold out by the time I get there and they are notorious for telling me oh we got one case of this and one case of that which I believe you know I have no reason to doubt them so moving right along these have been floating around as well and I really really like these I want these for outside on the patio probably not going to put pictures in these little hooks but something else more festive more patio related but I really really like these these are so pretty you got the little hooks right here they've got this on sideways because to hang it the hook is right here but they had these in the white and they also had them in the black so I got one of each because I really really like these I'm not sure yet what I'm gonna do with them they are just calling them nothing they're just calling them absolutely nothing they're by Greenbrier, <laughs> and that's it. So I'm, I'm assuming they're just like picture frames, you know, something that you can hang your graduate pictures in or whatever you want, your baby's pictures in. So yeah, I got one of each of those. And then I've been really going gaga, and I really need to calm myself down with the be happy stuff because, yeah, I feel like I'm going a little overboard, but that's typically my, my way, you know? <clears throat> So how I do, okay? <laughs> but I saw these. <laughs> these are so cute. Safer walls and more. Apply to clean, dry surface. These are the wall um, stickers with the bumblebees. And it says, be happy. It's going to match my rug. I want to put one on my wall by the front door once I put that mat down. And then I want to put one somewhere else. These are not going on gifts or packages because y'all know I'm just be crazy. I don't know what happened. I just don't get it. But I had to get two of them while I saw them just in case I want to put one in friend mail because I have collected so much bee stuff. But I absolutely love it. And all I have to do is see that bumblebee and I'm just like thrilled. And how, how, what a coincidence that I would find these. On the same day that I found the Be Happy um, doormat. So I was like, yes, I'll be happy. Thank you. And then I found these cute ones like I told you guys before. I love to decorate um, my niece's stuff. Um, Carmelita, when I send her stuff, I like to put these stickers on it. But this is for a friend. She likes everything oceanic or sea worthy. And so I'm hoping she doesn't have these again. And this just says pirate. <laughs> 
<laughs> and it's got the shark, the lighthouse, I don't know, is that a volcano down there? I don't know, it's pirate related. But I saw the lighthouse and it just reminded me of her because she loves the ocean and, you know, everything seaworthy. So I got that for her. And if she says she has it, then I'll just use it for my friend mail. And this one as well, I got this one for her. Because our stores pretty much sell the same thing. But I'm not always sure. But I just thought this was too cute. Reminded me, what's that cartoon movie? Was it The Little Mermaid? Under the Sea? Under the Sea. <laughs> so it's just got all these oceanic, fishy, seahorses, and octopus. And I was just like, oh my god, this is too cute. It's got the little blowfish there. I was like, oh, and of course he got to roar his ugly way in there. I was just like, oh my God, so cute. And they were front and back, finally. Okay, because the B ones wasn't, but I wasn't even mad about that. I didn't care. I really didn't care. I forgot to show y'all. But it's only, the B happy one was only on one side. So that's cool. But that is it, you guys. That is the end of my small little Family Dollar, Dollar Tree Haul. I hope you guys enjoyed watching my activities and festivities that I took place all day long. Because y'all know, I just got to be on the go. I got to do stuff to keep my mind busy. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Love, peace, and happiness. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Remember guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. I love you all so very much. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for all your love and support. Y'all have a blessed day. Bye.